What is up, YouTube? How are you guys doing today? Me, Ken, and Miko, aka Ocean Crash. Today, I'm going to talk to you guys about a few videos that are going to be coming up on this channel. Um, the videos that I have coming up um, are going to be my Yimmy's Coffee Shop videos. Um, it's been a pretty rough time right now with that. <laughs> um, we got some interesting news yesterday. But um, I'm going to basically be um, doing some things within the YouTube channel for that. I was contemplating about posting some videos for my coffee shop journey. Um, I was contemplating posting them up on a different channel. I decided to keep them on this channel. Um, it's my journey and I was like, you know what? The videos I think would be great if they were on here. Um, with that being said, I'm contemplating moving my channel name back to Canon Miko instead of Ocean Crash, and so that's something that's been on my mind again for some time. Hence, uh, you'll see I've tagged Canon Miko in a lot of my video titles now, because I'm just like, they need to be back to Canon Miko. Um, I feel like that was working for me well before, when I didn't have Ocean Crash and Canon Miko, so I'm going to go back to that. Um, with that being said, um, you're going to start seeing the videos. They will come from around June um, and they won't be present day videos so um, basically I started recording this series around June and I told myself hey I'm gonna report I'm gonna post these videos once I get closer to getting my place getting it worked on and a bunch of other things and with that being said I have the sign coming up soon um, my final permit um, approval for permits I've been submitted to the city um, but then I just got a really big roadblock as of yesterday, which is kind of preventing me from beginning construction. So, um, and basically has to do with plumbing, um, not fun stuff. Um, so, um, I'm hoping and praying to God about that. That kind of shines light on my way and my path for that. But, um, you're going to expect to see a lot of those videos on here. Um, and they're basically just going to be my journey as an entrepreneur, as someone in their twenties. Um, I started working on the coffee shop uh, when I was 8th grade, so I don't know, how old is that, 15? I don't know, I think 15, yeah, 16 is when you start high school, yeah, I was like 15, and I knew I wanted to open up a business, and I bought coffee, I was like, oh, I like coffee jobs, I like coffee, at the time, I, when I was 12, I hated coffee, then I saw my dad drinking it a lot, so I was like, let's consume some coffee, I hated it at first, but I was like, I'll give it another try. And I was like, nah, ugh. And I added cream in there, and I was like, oh. It was so good. And uh, I got stuck to it, and now I have it black, and I don't need to have cream in there. Um, and it's just, it stuck to me ever since. And then I kind of took that, carried it over, created a business plan, got it reviewed multiple times by multiple lawyers, had the lawyers approve it, kind of look at it, and just was a long journey. Um, and I kind of, I um, always tell people I don't come from a privileged fa privileged family. I'm a first generation, second generation immigrant. My parents immigrated here, so they're first generation um, from uh, Iraq, and I'm I am a Syrian. So my community plays a huge role in my in my coffee shop. It is called Yimmi's Cafe, which means mother in my language of Aramaic, um, arguably Neo Aramaic. Um, so yeah, it's just it's a huge part of who I am and I've, I'm I mean I've I've lost loved ones because of it because they didn't want me doing it um, I've had people accuse me of things um, I'll be straightforward with you guys my engagement broke off because of it <laughs> you know I was engaged and she didn't want me doing it uh, out of nowhere and we broke up because of it because I was like I'm not gonna stop something that you knew about and I've been working on for so many years of my life 10 11 years you know because of some selfish things so it's been a huge part of my life it's caused me a lot of pain and pressure but i would not trade that pain or pressure for anything in this world because it's molded me and shaped me into the strong and persevering individual who i am today to be honest with you and it's just so many people seem so excited about it and i had my hearing which that video should come up soon as well i'm gonna post that up i'm gonna post it up soon where i went to the village and they were just so excited. They're like, we want a coffee shop in Skokie. We really need a one that's not Starbucks or Dunkin'. So shocked a lot of a lot of the people that came and visited and supported me. So you'll see those videos. Um, pretty great. Uh, it starts in about June of 2019. Um, I started those videos, if I'm not mistaken. So um, those will start. It starts, starts there with me talking to getting. It starts for me looking for a, like a location, and it. 
it'll it'll catch up to modern day and time so it'll catch up to current time so i'm gonna release the videos i'm gonna post them up on youtube and then you'll get because i still document so you'll get more documentation like i just did one yesterday um and those will be current so um i just need created a backlog of the videos so those will be up you'll see them you'll love them um yeah so this is the intro video to the series <laughs> so i hope you guys can follow me on my journey uh, on creating the coffee shop and I hope you guys enjoy it um, and get as much uh, excitement as I do out of watching my own videos and me talking about opening up a coffee shop um, again fundraise this all myself um, didn't have anyone to really donate to me um, I, I did get donations but not thousands of dollars <laughs> um, it was there were small considerable helpful amounts from friends and family um, so great process um again like i said no financial support for family so this is all self-funded um, this is something i've been working on for some time now um, i'm not getting a loan i am using credit um credit cards to be exact but i haven't gotten a loan for the business either so um yeah that's it guys thank you so much i hope you guys enjoyed this video to get an idea of what's going on what's gonna what you're gonna see on this new series i'm excited this is one i'll be honest with you one of the main reasons why i started the youtube channel so I love you guys. Till later. Till next time. Bye. Peace.